Okay, maybe this battle we'll be able to see Sakia use her spell card. Um, I need defense buffs. Defense buff. Uh, chaser. Full screen. Full screen. Oh, we get to see it! Oh, just. Okay, as you can see, I like the effect how the text actually stops as well. As you can see, everyone cannot move except for Sakia. And now she can do whatever the hell she wants. Let's use this. What the hell does this do? Bonk, bonk. And that lasts us for two turns. Um. Okay. What does this do? Okay, this prevents the curse status effect at a super high probability. Excellent. And as you see, we open that part, we can... Well, we just open up a shortcut. What is up here? Get away from me, Mr. Guy. Come on, I wanna get through. I wanna get through about going to a battle. Come on. Okay, go. Oh crap, there's more of them. Okay, got another gold key. We have a shield of purgatory. What's this do? Okay, 30% chance of activation, 60 physical defense, 26 magic defense. Protects against the free melee or the free weapon types, as well as some protection against light and dark. Okay. Come on, game. Don't be like this. Okay. I do believe this is a shortcut to the first area. Go! Yep. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. I'm going to go back outside. Give me one second. Okay, I'm back. Now, we need to go back to that second gold key door. So, I do believe we need to go here. We need to go back through that first gold door, which is over here. Why is that enemy back? Oh well, whatever. Come on, Mr. Guy. I don't want to fight. I just want to get to the warp point. Because I don't want to... Um, battle. I don't like battles anymore. This game is very tedious in terms of battles. Come on. Go! Whew! Okay. Need to go around. Almost there. Okay, that's the second gold door. And we have reached the warp point. Excellent. Okay. Excellent, okay. Okay, I guess I'll show a quick little preview of the boss fights. Um, yeah, let's do that. I wonder who it is. Oh look, it's Oku! And of course she loves it down here. Although she's very bored apparently. I do like that sprite though. Looks quite nice. And now she's hungry. Oh look, it's her buddy. Okay, I'm gonna admit, I don't like the, um, the sprout of that cart. Anyway. Just some small talk. And it looks like they are aware of Rama's party rushing through this area, so... They're actually prepared this time. Oh god, them faces. Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh-oh. 
on you? Oh boy. Aww. Remy says she doesn't have food. Looks like the party wants to meet up with Satori. And of course, these two being Satori's pets, we're gonna have to fight them. Isn't that great? We have a cat that deals with corpses and some bird that has the power of, well, nuclear fission. So, how are we gonna deal with this? Oh, Notori has a cucumber. Maybe she can give it to them. Hey, Notori, give them a cucumber. Do you like cucumbers? Oh, they're eating it. Eh. Oh, darn, so close. <laughs> they were gonna let us pass. Oh, you can have cucumbers too. Oh, these two. Anyway, looks like we're gonna have to fight them now. Okay, as I said, this is just gonna be a quick preview of what's to come. I'll actually do this battle proper in the next video. Okay. Let's just concentrate on... You. Okay, the thing about this boss fight is that if Oku gets down to one third of a HP, stuff happens. <laughs> As you'll see very soon. Are we almost there yet? Yeah, we're almost there. Alright, Auron, if anyone goes down in the battle, Auron will revive them and they'll start attacking you. Or buffing them. Very bad. Why is it? I have to take her out first, don't I? Oh, Okay, this is what I wanted to show you for this boss fight. That! Okay, if 
Oku is the only one left in that boss fight, and she's down to less than one third of her HP, she will use Mega Flare. This hits everyone for like hundreds of damage and there's no way you can survive it. There are a couple of ways around this however, otherwise this game will be impossible to finish. But I will show you these methods in the next video as well as, well, how to deal with the battle overall. Okay, see you next time.